this show absolutely breaks through boundaries. Um, there's a lot of uh, stereotypical roles and positions in society for women and this show breaks through those roles and encourages um, people of all ages to to look at someone as they are individually in their story in their context these are interviews with real women made into monologues so it's how women really speak and that's important to be fleshed out in the play I feel like people are sexually repressed in our generation and that women's issues are rampant in our society and I don't think that people take it seriously and I feel like this this play brings light to that issue in a comic way without making it too serious. I was pretty raised to be open about that kind of stuff. Uh, and I'm taking on another character, so it's a lot easier than doing it in my own voice. I'm taking on an old lady voice, so it's like removing myself from the situation. I really love watching a group of girls who are completely different from one another find this common thread and learn from each other and grow from each other and bond and by the end of the show everybody's just fast friends and you know you see somebody walking through the student union you're just like oh hey and you're just like open there's this sort of, sort of openness that comes from talking about your vagina on stage in front of the half of the Boone population. It keeps you from being shy in your everyday life as well. I thought it was great. I'd seen some of the same acts before um, in the previous years, but they did a fantastic job. I loved it. It's like one of my favorite things to do in February. Um, it's, it brings awareness or a lot of reasons, so I just really enjoy it always. It was awesome. It was really interesting and funny and really eye-opening to a lot of the problems that are going on in society. Every single problem that you have, no matter how severe or how trivial, there's somebody else who has had a similar problem or a similar experience that can talk to you and make you feel better about it and not feel so closed off. And I think that's probably the most important part of the vagina monologues is just learning how to communicate those things.